Uh, excuse me, sorry, real quickly. Um, you actually just walked past me uh, just now. Okay. Uh, yeah, you look really good. I just thought I'd say hi. Oh, hi. A bit, a bit random, I know. But, yeah. Um, yeah, I just wanted to say hi. You kind hi. of caught my eye. Oh, okay. Uh, what, what, what's your name? Jane. Jane. Yeah. Are you American? I am American. Oh, okay. Yeah. I'm only here for a visit. Oh, fair enough. I leave tomorrow, so. Oh, okay. Are you from like LA? I am from LA. But I know I live... so much about you, it's crazy. I, but I'm from, how do you know about me? I know, it's really creepy. I've been, <laughs> I've been, I've been stalking you for like 10 years and I'm finally oh my... met you. No, you didn't. I'm joking, I'm joking. No, I'm, I'm from LA, but I live in New York. You know what it is? I think it's because you're so stylish looking and I just associate that with LA. Really? Compared to all these people? Yeah, come on. Oh. This is like uh, a week. Are you by yourself here or something? Uh, well, actually, I met my friend. I was just on my, on my way home. Oh, um, you are? You live here? And, yeah, I'm from oh, here. Yeah, okay. yeah. You know, and so you're here. only visiting? Huh? You're only here. I'm a flight crew. Oh, your cabin crew. Yeah. Oh, okay. For, I work for um, American Airlines. Oh, okay. That explains a lot, actually. Yeah. yeah, yeah. I mean, I can give you my number if you want. Do you? How long are you here for? Actually? I don't know. I leave tomorrow morning, but I'm here next week. Okay. Yeah. Why not? We I mean, can, whatever. You, you, do, you, do you come to London quite a bit? Then? I do actually, because okay. oh, I'm right. New York based, so we come here a lot. Oh, okay. I don't know if you want Instagram. I don't. Do know. you? Do you have WhatsApp? I don't have WhatsApp. What? What's wrong with you? I'm American. We don't use that. You, you Americans, you need to get with the times. Yes. I, I actually, I actually, because I was in um, LA like four, four years ago. Okay. No one, no one was really using it back then, and I was thinking like, this is really weird, and still people not really using it. It's kind right. of weird. Yeah, um, I don't have WhatsApp. Okay. I mean, uh, oh, yeah, I'll get, I'll get. Oh. I'll, I'll get your Instagram then. Oh, I'll get your Instagram. Okay. Um, I don't really use it that much, but one hour. No, you walked past me. I was about to cross the road, and then uh, yeah, just thought. Oh, I was like so into my music. Does Does this not happen much to you? In uh, uh, I'm surprised you don't get approached much. No. Because you were like so surprised when I um, approached yeah, you. Yeah, I was like, who the heck is talking? I mean, I'm used to <laughs> this talking. This is. It's, I think it's like a European like thing. Oh, okay. Been. Oh, is it really? I think it's a European thing. Uh, Maybe I, I think Americans are a bit shy when it comes to. I mean, we're assholes, so. Yeah, that's true. I'm, 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 I'm into I, I'm into assholes anyway, so. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm a very polite oh, British you are. guy. I'm a very polite British guy. So that's My why best friend's boyfriend is British, so he's English. Okay. Are you are you a bit of an asshole then? No, I'm not. I'm actually really nice. Oh, I was hoping you'd say you were, because I'm kind of into that. So like, oh, are you? Yeah. I'm nice. Okay. Maybe I can corrupt you a bit. I don't maybe. Know. Maybe yeah. you can corrupt me and make me an asshole. So. Yeah, yeah. What, what, what's the plan tonight anyway? Are you um, being friends? Or? No, actually, I have to go to bed. Oh, that's so boring. I know. I you, like you're in London. You I need have to. to Wake up. I'm here all the time. I have to okay. wake up early tomorrow. Ne next actually. time when we meet, we'll, oh for sure, we'll, we'll, keep in touch. My Instagram. I'll, I'll send you a message. If okay. You, when did you say you're back? In two weeks? Um, or? next week. Okay. Mm -hmm. I'll see if I'm free. If I am, we'll have a we'll have an interesting I time. We'll have a fun time. Sounds good. Nice to meet you. I know right. this is like really random. Name? Ed. 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 Jay. I'll send you a message on uh, Instagram. All right. Nice, nice to, to meet, meet you. you. Bye. Take care. Bye. So this girl was quite nice and friendly, quite bubbly personality, which is quite ideal, you know, when you're doing day game. Uh, because it allows for you know quite a fun interaction because you know sometimes when you approach you get a bit of um, you know a bit more somber kind of tone from the girl or maybe she's a bit like shy and she's not really giving you that much uh, but yeah this was quite a fun uh, interaction a little bit on the short side uh, but she was kind of giving signals that she was wanting to kind of carry on even though she was giving you giving me quite sort of uh, receptive signals as well so quite um, you know interested signals uh, but that, that can be the case sometimes, you know, sometimes you'll get the girl giving you kind of mixed signals So, you know, some form of interest in terms of, you know, smiling, good body language uh, Engaging with you properly uh, But then other times, you know, she's kind of, you know, she has somewhere to go She's maybe in a bit of a rush, whatever, that's quite normal um, <clears throat> But yeah, at the beginning, she was a little bit uh, taken aback, maybe a bit surprised at the beginning and so it's just a, you just have to kind of reassure them and just carry on, you know, commit to what you're doing, you know, you've approached her, so don't kind of back down from that, just carry on, be that kind of reassure, reassuring presence, uh, and just, yeah, just carry on with the momentum that you've, um, you know, you've opened strong, so just carry that momentum forward, even if she's a bit, like, surprised by it, or, you know, so sometimes she can be giving you a bit of a weird look, and... You know, for some guys that can affect them. They can feel like, oh, maybe I shouldn't have done that. Or they kind of uh, feel like maybe they shouldn't have approached the girl. But no, you should still approach 100%. It doesn't matter if she gives you uh, a slightly weird reaction. Um, 
it's just about committing and just owning what you're doing and just doing the best you can really but yeah the rest of the interaction was quite uh short but quite fun um and that that's ideal you know well at least the fun part um because yeah like you know whenever she says something like you know she says that she's an arsehole so that's great that's a perfect uh you know thing for her to say in that moment to then you know spike up the conversation a bit make it more fun make it more interesting spike the emotions a bit don't just keep it to boring chat so yeah this was um, quite a fun interaction and yeah this is what you can do you know just keep it uh, fun and light-hearted the other thing to note is to not be afraid to just say something that seems a bit crazy or a bit outlandish because it's so much better to make that joke that seems a bit you know crazy rather than just having like a boring conversation which you know a lot of guys do do that so for example when she says she's an asshole you know maybe some guys would be like oh no you're not an asshole oh no you know that that kind of thing but it's just like you know when you actually play it up a bit go along with the joke uh, it can it can make the interaction far more lively and far more interesting from kind of a more sort of emotional point of view from a more emotional perspective so that's what you should be trying to do like when the opportunity arises in your interactions I mean sometimes there won't be any, that much to think about but and that's okay but you know if something does come to you don't be afraid to actually say it that, that's the key thing um, because yeah you don't really want to be having kind of bland boring conversations because remember what you're actually trying to do here is you're trying to interact with them uh, not in a necessarily really kind of logical way like you're trying to get from A to B but you're kind of meandering kind of wherever the, you know the conversation takes you and that's how you can actually build a more kind of interesting connection with someone and that's what's gonna make you come across potentially more charismatic and more interesting and they are going to be more likely to want to you know be in your presence again uh, so to bear that in mind and yeah don't be afraid to say stuff that maybe you know you might think it's not really appropriate or maybe it's a bit too much to say or it's a bit crazy now nah, you're better off saying it you know don't don't hold yourself back too much but obviously there is a balance because you know you go, you go too far then it just comes across too crazy or too um, uncalibrated and maybe she it could even be borderline creepy in some cases so it's, it's good to find that balance uh, and, and it can take practice so you just got to go out there and practice this stuff cheers for watching if you'd be interested in one-to-one -one coaching with me where we'll go out in public and work on your approaching girls or more generally with your social confidence please visit my website ed-game.com